So when we last talked, you had just gotten here, okay. and uh, you talked a little bit about who you wanted to meet and so on. Who have you met, and what impression did they leave on you? Okay, very good. Um, so I've been able to meet with one of, like, three of the laureates, pretty much, that I really liked, and the talks with John, Alexi, because they work mostly in machine learning and deep learning things that I really wanted to, um, yeah, you know, find out what projects they're working on and also, you know, get to talk to them about the number of things since I'm also working on applying machine learning techniques to bioinformatics. And I've been really um, inspired by, you know, their thoughts, by um, what they've accomplished, because I participated in discussion groups by organized or led by both of them, as well as um, in a number of workshops that, you know, I, I have really learned a lot, that's just it. And to be honest, I think that um, the Heidelberg Laureate um, Forum is something that should, um, you know, continue because it inspires students like me, you know, uh, to continue to do research, you know, consistently and hopefully at some point we would be able to make an impact in the field, whichever field we work on, just like the laureates have and they accomplish so much. So it's something that is, you know, for me it's um, very beneficial. I mean, I've, I've learned a lot, so it's really beneficial. Okay. So, um, what it, was it, was there a single thing that you think that you picked up from this? Was there an idea that you're going to go home and pursue or anything like that? Well, yes. You know, um, one of the ideas came from one of the, I think, a couple of the PhD students that I interacted with during the course of the meeting and while I was presenting my work. And um, my intention is to go back and then, you know, um, work on these ideas and hopefully come up with some findings on the basis of that. So it really helped. I also liked the fact that we went through um, some kind of training on how to present our work to the audience because I was part of those that presented um, the poster flash where we had to stand in front of everybody and then talk about our work in you know a short amount of time and we learned a lot about you know how to be confident when you present your work you look at the audience be conscious of time hit the you know key points structure your presentation in such a way that you capture the background of your work the how approach i mean how you achieved the results and then where you are or whatever results you have and things like that and it was really good because I think what I have gained from that um, workshop will go with me beyond HLF5 okay to the future in helping me to be able to even you know make presentations and talk about my work and present findings to some other you know um, participants of some conference or meetings elsewhere. So, you know, that's one of the great benefits. Meeting with the laureates during lunch sometimes or some coffee break or, you know, um, at some point or the other during the event is usually um, an opportunity for me to also, you know, walk up to them and tell them about what I do, learn more about their works or whatever pet projects they are working on as well as um, being able to get that inspiration. Once again, who did you meet with? I met with um, John Hopcroft, I met with Alexi, I met with Jeff Dean, and these are people that really work in, of course, I know Alexi works in computer vision and image processing things and, you know, um, pretty much self-supervised learning, okay? I do machine learning, currently I do more of supervised you know, and not as much in terms of unsupervised or self-supervised. But I met with him, we interacted, we talked, you know, and I was trying to, I even participated in his discussion group and learned a number of things there. I met with Jeff Dean, you know, he talked more about what they are doing at Google um, and um, 
That was really great. I met John Hopcroft and a number of other laureates. I mean, this has been a um, very great event for me, I think. And I hope that, you know, there will be um, enough funding going forward for the HLFF to continue to fund, you know, students or people in their early career stage like me to continue to come and participate in future HLF meetings. And then hopefully we have um, young researchers better prepared for the future. Anything else you'd care to say? Um, you said a lot already. Okay. But, <laughs> but. So, um, yeah. Well, what else I would like to say is just to re-emphasize that I believe that this meeting goes a long way in helping the scientific community to grow and have more people that can make impact and then on the long run helping the world, okay? Which is, for me, an event that should continue, you know, as much as possible, as much as there's funding to get people over and um, to Heidelberg or wherever the event will be in Germany and then to keep on helping and inspiring students and young researchers at whatever stage they are to continue with research. Thank you very much. Sure, thanks. All right. Yeah. Bye.